Hello again everyone, and welcome to another Ultimate Fighter episode of View. This one is for episode 11, Bone on Bone. Really not too much to talk about in this episode, so let's just get into it. We start with the two fights that took place in the episode, which was Martin Vosak defeating David Tamer by majority decision after um, two rounds, and then Julian Rosa defeating Abner Yavaris by split decision after three, after three rounds. That's three. That's four. I'm stupid. <laughs> and uh, I do want to briefly talk a bit about Rosa before we carry on. <sighs> I really, really don't like him. I mean, he was the only American to to make it this far, and to make it to the uh, would it be the uh, yeah the semi-finals? But why did it have to be him? I would have been happy if it was Grudmacher, Galicchio. Tom Lee, you know, three fighters on the American side that are actually really good. I like them. I like them a lot. I, I just don't like it as I, I really don't. <laughs> I mean, it can kick my ass, obviously, but... I, I just don't like it. And, uh... After the fight, uh, after Rosa has his fight, Artem Lobov calls out Rosa. Saying that he was gifted with the two decisions, and Artem pretty much wanted Dana to make a fight between him and Arosa happen. Which is what happens when the semi final matchups are announced, as that is one of them, and the other one is Saul Rogers against Martin Vosak. Which is kind of obvious considering they're the only other two left now. So, uh, yeah, pretty much Arm Lobov says to Arosa, there's not going to be any more gifts. You know, Christmas has stopped for you. No more. Uh, winning decisions, and I agree with Artem because Arosa, like, I, I I agree with pretty much what everyone said. He's a single shot fighter. He did way too much dancing around. I don't know how good his record is, but he <sighs> the style of fighting is meant to be frustrating. And it does frustrate me, even though I'm nowhere close to being a, even an amateur mixed martial artist, even a freaking like. Whatever's lower than amateur. I'm not even anywhere close to that. But I don't see how Rosa managed to impress the judges all that much. I mean Yovaris I think did a great job against Rosa. And who was his first bones again? I can't remember. Meji Baghdad. I thought Meji did a great job against him. But no, the judges gave it to Julian. And that's not any hyperbole. They gave it to Julian. But anyway, uh, that's pretty much it for this one, and I'll talk about 12 when, pretty much whenever I get the chance. So uh, that's it, I hope you all enjoyed it, sorry it was a short one, like subscribe if you want, and I'll see you all next time.